What's going on guys? Today I'm going to show you guys how to zero gap the Stylecraft Sabre trimmers. You guys see the gold one, this is the original one. Just got the black in and we need to adjust it. So I'm going to show you guys how to do that. They will operate the same exact way. If you guys pay attention, you can just follow along and set yours. All right guys, so you can see we got the black Sabre right here. I have the Stylecraft screwdriver. It's just a little bit smaller. I have another screwdriver that has two different tips. So we got a small tip, a little bit of a fatter tip. Depending on what we're going to need, I'm not really sure. We're going to start off by taking these two screws out. Go ahead and switch this to the smaller one. Just pop these two screws out, take the blade off and then we can set it. All right guys, so you can see here, this is the zero gap setter. It comes on the trimmer. It kind of doubles as a blade cover. So it probably came on the trimmer. That is how we're gonna set the blade. So you guys see, we will take the blade, go ahead and slide it in from one end, go ahead and put it in there. Now we're gonna loosen these two screws. That is what holds this blade in position. So we're just gonna loosen them. Now you guys can see we can move this blade around. It should wiggle a little bit. I can, oh, I can kind of twist it and go left and right. So all we're gonna do is press it all the way towards the blade setter. This lip right here keeps the blade from going too far. We're just gonna press it towards. I got my middle finger in the back holding it, still holding the whole thing still, and I have my other two fingers holding the blade where I want it. Then I'll just come in, snug these two screws down, we'll go ahead and slide it out of here and we can check it out. Now after you guys get it set, you wanna look close. You can see that is like absolutely zero gap. So I like a little bit less gap than that. I'm gonna go ahead and throw these on there and use them like this and test them out. You guys just wanna look at this blade and make sure it's not going over the top of the back blade. So you can see if you look close, I mean that thing is absolute zero. You can kinda see a little bit of the steel blade in the back right there, but this is set really close. So now we'll just throw it back on the trimmer and we'll test them out. So guys, there's two grooves on each side of this black piece. We just wanna put those metal tabs in there. Then we'll press it down and it should go over the screw holes. Sorry, I gotta get a good grip on it. And once you have it over the screw holes, guys, you just throw the screws back in. Now you guys can see with the screws loose, I can move it around a little bit. So I wanna make sure that it is pushed all the way up towards the top. Hold it down snug, then we'll go ahead and snug these all the way down, and we should be done with setting this trimmer. Of course, before you put it on anybody, guys, you wanna double check and make sure that it's not too sharp and that uh, you didn't get anything out of alignment while tightening the screws. So now I'll just pick it up, turn it on, make sure it goes in the middle here. We don't want it going over either end. You guys can see it's moving perfectly from side to side. You can also put your hand here and kind of tell if it's centered. Again, double check that gap, make sure that it's good. They look good, now we can test them out on somebody. All right guys, that is it for my zero gapping video on the Starcraft Sabres. If you guys want to check out some of my other zero gapping videos, I have a whole bunch from the Gold FX to the Detailer, Slimline, Hitter, most of the main trimmers that are out. I'm gonna show you guys in those videos how to zero gap them. So if you guys like to do me a favor, smash that thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below and let me know if you grabbed these Sabres and how you got them hidden. And I'll catch you guys next time.